wonderful there is a very wonderful border also has come with the help of this footer option okay that is how we create header and footer this is how we create header and footer so very easy and very simple and very important also and very beautiful also okay uh, next option is page border option page border option i have already shown you i have already shown you how can you uh, make the page border option okay paragraph border along with paragraph border i have shown you page border also okay mm, coming to the next uh, page layout yes now suppose if i select this and i go to column i make it two columns then you see it will it will come like this now you some books have you seen some books like this two columns the books divided into two columns so how the page is divided into two columns how in this way in this way so the writer will type it first of all the writer or the typist will or the author uh, don't say typist because uh, uh, typist everybody may not like typist the word typist so please do not use the word typist suppose you can say the creator of that document that will be uh, that will be okay the creator of the document the creator of the document will type it first and then select it and then with the help of this column can you see in page layout if you are in home tab then from home tab you have to come to page layout tab and from here you'll get the column option and you see one two three okay whatever you want you can that number of columns you can get it from here okay my dear students i am sure you are getting interest you are taking interest the next option the next option is that how can i insert images how can i insert images very simple from here go to the insert option go to picture and uh, let me see in uh, desktop i have some pictures here so you 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 have to you have to download some pictures or you should have some pictures from before only okay suppose this is one picture so in this way in this way i can bring a picture and from here i can reshape it i can make it small i can make it big <coughs> i can make it small i can make it big i can move it okay i can move it i can take it here also i can take it here also i can right click and send back i can send it uh, send back or send uh, send behind text i can make it send behind text okay it will come like this it will become very beautiful it will look very nice okay then the next option is inserting shapes how do we insert shape from here we insert shape uh, do you remember in the very beginning i have used already this shape i have already used this shape now suppose this is one shape this is the circle shape this is a circle shape and uh, from this uh, uh, shape fill from this shape fill i can put color in this shape i can put color in this shape whatever color i like i can put color in this shape as well as i can put two different color also if i click here the last option is pattern option the the previous option before pattern the second last option is the texture option i can put here beautiful textures like this i can put here beautiful textures like this and i can right click here and i can add some text here suppose happy b i r t h birthday happy birthday to you okay in this way i can beautifully design i can beautifully design whatever i like in this way i can beautifully design whatever i like okay and then i was talking about two different color let's see how can i apply so i have to jump from home tab to the format tab and before i jump to the format tab what i have to do you see right now the format tab is not available why the format tab is not available because i have not selected this object i have to select this object now you see automatically the format option has come now if i click here from the pattern the last option is the pattern option take the pattern option go to the first tab gradient tab and then from the color take two colors and you see you can use here you can use here two colors you can use here two colors very beautiful wow very nice 
from here you can use two colors so this is about inserting symbols and this is the end of chapter 6 this is the this is the end of I'll just remove this and I'll write here end of chapter 6 I'm sure you have learned so much I'm sure you have enjoyed so much and you will enjoy more in the next chapters and uh, okay already I have started creating video for Microsoft Excel spreadsheet so once I complete Microsoft Word I will start with uh, Microsoft Excel so God bless you all today thank you so much have a nice day stay safe